Hey everyone, welcome, welcome, welcome. Just a really quick update to the procurement standards video I made a while back. I will link it in the description if you haven't seen it or if it's been a while and you want to watch it again. In that video, I described several methods for purchasing goods and services with federal grants, each of which has a dollar threshold associated with it. Now, those thresholds are updated annually by the federal government, so this video is going to bring you up to speed on the fiscal year 2018 amounts. Let's roll. So here we go. As you can see, the previous amounts are in the left-hand column. Micro purchases, 3,000. Simplified acquisition, 150. And the new amounts as of June 20th, 10,000 and 250,000 respectively. If you align your purchasing policies and procedures to the federal amounts, you'll need to make a few revisions to your manual. And just as a reminder, micro purchases allow your organization to buy goods and supplies valued up to the established amount without having to request price quotes or do a lot of comparison shopping. If you find the item or service you need and you believe the cost is reasonable, you can go ahead and purchase it. If you have a lower threshold, however, in your policies, stick with that amount unless your board wants to raise the amount to the federal standards, but that's entirely up to you and your board of directors. The simplified acquisition threshold update is significant in a couple of places. First, it raises the amount for the small purchase method of procurement. And second, it determines when competitive proposals are necessary. Real quickly, small purchases are used for relatively small routine purchases of goods, services, services, and supplies that don't exceed the simplified acquisition threshold. Uh, the key here with um, small purchases, small purchases, is you need to get an adequate number of price quotes from qualified vendors before spending any money. And I think, as I mentioned, <clears throat> excuse me, in the other video, an adequate number of quotes is considered two or more. Now, above the simplified acquisition threshold, and you're entering into the competitive proposals arena when you have to uh, formally issue an RFP and solicit bids from vendors and go through a review and selection process. Again, if your organization uses a lower threshold for either micro purchases or, uh, you know, uh, for formal bids or small purchases, you know, that's the amount you want to follow, unless your board wants to adjust your policies and procedures to match the federal amounts. You know, as I've mentioned before, you know, in my other video and other places online, you're welcome to use amounts that are more restrictive than federal regs. You just can't make them less restrictive. Here are a couple of screenshots from the OMB memo authorizing the increases with, you know, kind of the relevant language underlined. I'll have a link to the memo in the description as well. Uh, I probably didn't need to include this slide, but I like to source everything whenever possible, just so people can check it out for themselves. I mean, I'm just a, I'm just a guy that enjoys managing federal grants, but, um, you know, you can double check me, that's fine. And I will have that link and you can read the entire memo for yourself. Um, that's just kind of my thing. Anyway, uh, what else? Uh, nothing else, that's it. That is all I have. You know what, if you have any questions, as always, please email me through my website or reach out on social media. I am here to help. If you found this useful, Go ahead and like it or give it a thumbs up. 
And feel free to comment if you want. I love the feedback. And be sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss future presentations. They won't always be as brief as this one, but hopefully equally or more stimulating than this. <laughs> well, I don't know. Uh, it, was, it was good for me, but then again, I enjoy this stuff. So anyway, that's all I've got. I'm just rambling now. So thanks, and I will see you next time.